It's June 2nd. Are we going to have a baseball season? Honestly, I think that we are. I really believe that when it's all said and done, when you understand the necessity, why there needs to be a baseball season, how the players and the owners need to realize that baseball will fall off a cliff. It will be defunct in terms of popularity if they don't have a campaign. I think that you're going to see these sides meet in the middle. And what's the middle? The players want 114 games as per their last proposal, according to multiple reports. The owners could implement something, and Jeff Passan from ESPN wrote this story. MLB has discussed playing a shorter schedule where players get their full pro-rated salaries. And baseball wouldn't propose it, they would implement it. 50 games in the regular season. Look, I wasn't a math major in Syracuse. I took one math class. Sophomore year, probability and statistics. I got a B minus. Thank you very much. But if you look at an average of 114 and 50, hey, you're going to play baseball to the tune of about 82 games this year. What, what a concept. Listen, I think when it's all said and done, we are looking at 80, 82 games for this upcoming campaign. I think that that's where the players and the owners are going to settle. I think that the player is going to end up taking 47, 48% of their prorated salaries. I think that's, at the end of the day, what's going to transpire. So instead of the 50% that they agreed upon on March 26th, I think it'll end up being about 47, 48% because it benefits them if they're going to play and make 47, 48%. Not a case where if you make more money, you lose 70% of your salary, 80% like they were throwing around with Mike Trout and Derek Cole, which was absolutely insane. I think both sides realize baseball, Chevrolet, Apple Pie, July 4th, you know, there's zero trust when it comes to the Players Association and the owners and the commissioner, Rob Manfred. I had Buster Only on my Sirius XM radio show. He talked about this. It's, it's really sad. But if they don't have a season with everything going on in the country, baseball will never, ever be the same. So I believe by the middle of next week, I hope next Monday, we're looking at a baseball schedule that features... 80 to 82 games, and I think that it's going to be tremendous, and they're going to own the month of July, and you can appreciate the stars that will be on display, and I think that's where this thing will ultimately meet in the middle and settle, and it better for the overall growth and health of Major League Baseball, because if they don't play this year, and then they still have a CBA they have to work out before next season, baseball will never, ever recover, so I believe we're looking at a Meeting of the minds in the middle, around 82 games. Players will get about 47, 48% of their salaries that they were scheduled to get this season. And we're going to play ball, and it's going to be glorious.